set sail from the Falklands to the island of South Georgia with a team of wildlife photographers. South Georgia is a remote, mountainous island approximately 900 nautical miles away and south of the Antarctic Conversion Zone. Crossing the conversion zone, the temperature noticeably dropped. We had at times just 2 degrees Celsius inside the pilot house. The crew used cheap skin rocks to help keep themselves warm when on watch. And no sooner had we crossed south of the zone, snow started to fall and a biting cold set in. We covered the distance in four and a half days, arriving at the island that is known for its extreme conditions and where the weather dominates. Here, cold Antarctic waters wrap around the island with temperatures from two degrees Celsius in the summer to minus one degree Celsius in the winter. This is a contributing factor to its extremely cold, wet, windy and snow-covered landscape. It is estimated that approximately 56% of the island is covered in snow and ice. It has a number of beautiful glaciers and some of the icebergs we saw would have been carved from these glaciers or had traveled up north from the Antarctic region. The wildlife we saw was spectacular with the number of fur seals, elephant seals and king penguins on a huge scale. It wasn't always like this though. Around the 1780s, sealing really took off in South Georgia and fur seals were hunted to near extinction. By the turn of the 20th century, sealing licenses were required in order to hunt. This continued until 1965 when Grit Bicken shut down, the last of the whaling stations. to approximately 400,000 elephant seals. The colourful kings walk in a regal-like manner, a steady pace so as to not overheat. They set out on their march whatever the wind blew. And in South Georgia, it blows. We experienced blizzards that brought screaming winds and a searing cold, and it often came out of nowhere. We came across a number of king penguin colonies. These were a joy to observe, as the chicks were quite curious of our presence. They are not shy to approach. Elephant seals are the largest of all the seal species. Although their size was intimidating, they were the more docile of the seals we came across. However, when the males were sparring, you made sure to keep your distance. The males often had wounds and patches of blood as a result of a recent match with another male. Georgia is the home of the iconic king penguin. We're here in Salisbury Plain, the second largest colony on the island with hundreds and thousands of penguins. on their belly. So it's wing, wing, foot, foot. Wing, wing, foot, foot.
We greatly enjoyed our time in South Georgia with the wildlife photographers and look forward to our return. We hope you enjoy our short video.